Hello there, everyone. This is TexCoin. Hope everybody's doing fine. And what I have here are three items, basic items, that I promised to all my viewers and subscribers I would share the items or the magnification that I use to find all these interesting coins that I've been sharing with all of you. And this is how I find them. And these are three of the magnification type of items that I use to find this unique, neat, awesome findings. The first one's going to be the Carson 5 time Mini Bright LED magnifier. Of course, it's got a, a protective sleeve on it. The protective sleeve here. Is your on and off switch and it helps protect the magnifying glass now I don't know if you notice but I just turn on the light okay and it's gives out really good lighting and the magnification on this Carson it's really really nice now, this magnifier does require three AAA batteries. I use this items because it, uh, it's helped me a lot. And I was able to um, use this in finding all this stuff. All the coins that I've been sharing, this is what's been helping me out. I've gotten these items at Amazon, and they're not that expensive. Some of us can't really afford all this sophisticated type of uh, magnification on our coins. But we do like collecting coins and seeing all this nice variety type of errors that are out there. This is going to be the Carson Time 5 Mini Bright LED Magnifier with Protective Sleeves. This one runs between $8 and $10. This one here, it's very similar to your 5 time. This one here is also a 5 time power LED okay, magnifier. But this one's called the Lumni Pop 5 time power LED magnifier or the LP66 as they call it. It runs between $12 and $15. Now, as you can see, the on, see that power button here? Well, the way you turn it on is you press it forward, forward or the up motion. And it pops up or pops out your magnifying glass. Now, if you can see your on off switch right there, if you turn off your light, LED light, and you don't need because it's bright outside or you're gonna do something outside with it or you find a coin and you wanna look at it, you don't need the lighting, so you turn off your LED light. If you're indoors the way I usually do it, I turn it on. Button on, and it's on. You want to protect the uh, the magnifying glass. You put it back, slide it back in there, and you can just store it wherever you like. Now. This requires battery as well. This is just to protect your batteries from popping out. It does require as well your AAA batteries, three of them. And it uh, gives out a really good lighting. I mean, really good. Especially when it's the, the brand new batteries, it's really, really bright. Okay, remember this is your Carson. Lumipop 5x Power LED Magnifier.
or the LP66. Now, whenever I find something interesting on a letter, like on a dime, for example, or a penny, and I really can't make it out because I don't have the sufficient magnification on neither of these two, I go to my third resource, which this one is really cool because it really, really magnifies up to 120 times. It goes from 60, which is there, to 120 times. So it's really, it would really get you up close. And you can, you can actually see um, the difference of what's, um, what it looks like to bring it up really close, especially if it doesn't belong in that coin or whatever you're looking at. Now this would be your focus, as you can see. This here, this will bring into focus. You see it popping in and out. It just went in. Now this is coming out. See it? And then this will bring it up close. Once you bring it up close to wherever um, you want it or where you think you saw it, you start adjusting your focus and and where you think you can actually get a really good view at it. Now, this button here, as you can see it, LED. You press your button, and it turns on the light. So you can see it right there. Off, on. You put your coin underneath, and it's actually going to... You'll be able to see the, the light on the coin. You, sh you should be able and you will be able to see the light. It throws it. That's why it's at an angle. It throws it to the coin and it actually, uh, you'll be able to see it really, really well. Turn it off. Press the button again. Now, this one also requires battery. One. Double A battery I use this Carson micro bright plus 60 times by 120 times power led pocket microscope or in other words they call it the mm-300 this one runs between eight and ten dollars or it could run from ten to twelve dollars I get all these items at Amazon. So it's, it's cheaper there, as everybody's aware. Really good items. But this is what I use to find and share all these nice findings that I share with all of you. And as you wanted me to do is give you the information on what I use to find all these nice looking unique coins. This type of errors that, that I've been sharing with all of you. But I have been asked and finally I was able to find a little time because I like to view my coins and stuff and find and, and I get excited and I want to share these other findings with all of you. But I said, you know what, I have to share this special video to all my viewers and all my subscribers so they too can make the findings and maybe come up with some of these beautiful coins that are out there with these beautiful errors. So there you have it. Three items. Very simple, very um, easy, small items. You don't have to have a big old case for them. Pocket, pocket, pocket. And not bad and not a bad price either. So, with this, I am hoping that you guys get out there and start finding all these really nice coins that are still waiting to fall 
in your hands. Hope you like it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope I gave you some information. If you have a comment or any other type of information that I can help you with, I'll be glad to provide that information for you. And um, send me a comment. Um, I just want to thank all the subscribers that are all around the world that subscribe to my channel. Uh, Japan, uh, Korea, Vietnam, the Philippines, uh, Venezuela, Spain, Morocco, uh, Russia, um, Ukraine, uh, all the United States, of course, my US of A. Thank you all for subscribing to my channel and liking and viewing my videos. And I'm going to continue to post this interesting finds using this great items that I've just shared with you. You all be safe. Take care. Bye-bye.